Kenyan man, there are some good Kenyan men. If you get a good Kenyan man, my channel I'm Prudence Holly and if you're new and you haven't subscribed please do well to click on the subscribe button and um, I have a guest here today I've been telling you guys so much about Kenya youtubers they are free and they are open for collabs and I have another Kenya youtuber here her name is Linda Mary <laughs> I'm so excited that she could make it for me and she came all the way from her house to my hotel and I'm super excited so today's topic, tell them, tell them. So today's topic is what Nigerians think about Kenyans or what Nigerians think about Kenya as a country. Mm -hmm. So because most Nigerians have this, mm -hmm. this ideology of Kenya being a very hot country. Oh, weather wise, yes. I thought Nigeria is hotter than Kenya. That's what I thought too. <laughs> <laughs> but coming here, Kenya is cold. Mm -hmm. And it's lovely, the weather is super lovely. And most Nigerians they think Kenya is not a good place to come for vacation. Well, Kenya is one of the best tourist destinations, I'm telling you. Tell them, <laughs> let them come, book your flight tickets, come. Yeah. And Mombasa, I went to Mombasa. Yeah, Mombasa. For two days, but it was raining all through. Oh, which part of Mombasa? Uh, where did you go to specifically? Did you go to the beach? Were you just in the hotel? Yeah, just in the hotel, but oh, it was raining. The yeah, no, it's a rainy season. We in April, it's normally a rainy season. Yeah. April and May, April. And then, but after that, Mombasa is normally hot actually. It was hot, but I was craving <laughs> for Nairobi weather because Nairobi weather is so nice. Yes. And it's refreshing. If you make up, guys, mm -hmm. and you step out, you will not even think of, oh, my makeup is dripping down with sweat and everything. It will stick on your face for long. <laughs> the weather here is nice. No, it's super nice. You guys, you guys should come. Relocate to Kenya. <laughs> so the other uh, ideology they had about Kenya, the girls has big butts. Oh, that okay. big, grounded <laughs> like South African ladies. But I can literally count how many Kenya girls I've seen with big asses. There are few. So what do you think about that? It's not all Kenyan ladies that have big. The thing about Kenyan ladies is that we come in all shapes and sizes. I'm telling you, they are very slim ones. They are ones who have a lot of big bang bang. They are tall ones. They are short ones. They are dark ones. We have come in variety. So not all of them have a big nash. But there's one <laughs> tribe in Kenya called the Luo, where I come from. I don't have that big nash that they do. But 95% of the ladies from that, from my Your tribe, tribe, they have big, big. I'm telling you, extra big nash. Wow. Oh, it's <laughs> you would have taken it now. You would have taken it now. You would have taken it now. The next perception Nigerians about Kenyans mm -hmm. are is the community being poor or the country being poor, mm -hmm. but they don't know the technology built that is in Kenya recently. Because when I came in, I was like, "Wow, this country is so technology infested. Like it's so, it's sweet, nice. I don't know how to explain the technology part, but it's better than Nigeria." We are advanced, but then when it comes to technology, so many people from other countries have said we are advanced. Yes. Kenya is not poor. Just like other other countries, you may find that some regions are wealthier or have more resources yeah. than others. But generally, Kenya is not poor, and Kenyans are not poor. Yeah. <laughs> You've heard it. Kenyans are not poor. So Nigerians stop thinking that Kenyans are poor. Yeah. Kenya is very lovely, uh, a very good tourist mm. place to be. Most yeah, like and they are very free. Like white people are home. very free. Coming here and walking, strolling, you can see them jogging around without yeah. security. But in Nigeria, it's not like that. Have you even seen the roads? Yeah, the roads are like the roads. super awesome. <laughs> <laughs> and they have lights, constant lights. You just need to pay your bills. Slowly, that is coming mm. to Nigeria because we have meters now, so mm. you have to just pay your bills yourself. Mm. It's slowly coming though, mm. but it hasn't Rest really been there. We are there. We have lights 24 7. If there's a problem actually, and you're not going to have lights, so even notified because that's like 1%, but 99% of the time when yeah. you switch on the lights, the lights are the electricity, we have it full time. Yeah. So the next perception Nigerians have is the food. Mm. 
I've not really had someone talk about Nigeria and um, Kenya food, but me mm. as a person, as a tourist here in Kenya, mm. the food is good. Oh, uh, have you had? What did you eat? Um, you the that rice that? and the sauce, <laughs> but I don't like the veggies. Okay. That vegetable. Which which one? And the cornstarch. Green or green green? It was green. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like it. And the cornstarch, they say it's like fufu. There's no way the cornstarch is like fufu. No, ours is harder. It's kind of it's hard. hard. It's not as soft so as So do you eat it like with your hand or with cutleries? No, with your hands. Wow. You call it ugali, just mm, like this. We like it like that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And the last but not the least, because there are so many perceptions Nigerians have about Kenyans. Till you go, you will never know. So don't assume and think about a country badly. So the last one, but the least, is love. They say um, Kenyan men don't love like the whites or Nigerians or the Ghana men. Kenyan men are harsh. They will literally cheat like three for four days before coming back home. They will make their wife or spouse know that they have a side chick outside no is that true what happens is that okay if you date people from other places especially nigeria yeah. i'm telling you so if you date a nigerian man and you date a kenyan man there's there's, there's a difference there's on the level of like romance yeah and then men are kind of romantic no? guys hold your ears <laughs> if you are dating a nigerian man now hold your ears grab that man because kenya girls will rush him i'm telling you they are looking, see you're saying that your guy your boyfriend is not perfect they will take his flaws they love nigeria but they kenyan women love nigeria women i'm a west african woman in general but yeah, some of some of those things are, are true. I think some of them are just general for men. For men, some men cheat. You no, know, some are general for men. But it's true that compared to other countries, Kenyan women sometimes, if they've t tested, like if they've dated people from other countries, they normally prefer that. other countries. My Kenyan people don't kill me. Please <laughs> don't kill her. No, no, no. She's just explaining to Nigerians about Kenya men loving their women here yeah, and yeah. you've heard it from her, mm -hmm. her but mouth and she's saying the truth but if you get a good Kenyan man there there are some good Kenyan men if oh. you get a good Kenyan man you hit the like man jackpot 30 <laughs> percent because my people will kill me but yes they are they are they are they are not that it's like all of them are majority but they are good Kenyan men so <laughs> we will pray to get them and another one, I've been hearing, like my husband said, he said, um, most people here don't get married because he's not seeing rings on their finger. Is that is that true? Mm. Or they get married but they don't prefer to put on their rings? Uh, people do, I'm saying, yes, let's say they get married, but not everyone gets married, like going to the church and doing oh, okay. a wedding. Okay. Some do a traditional marriage. Yeah, so that, is, that, that is, that is, mm -hmm. so far it's traditional, yes. yes. Others also do the can we stay where you live with your man okay. and you never get married. Others also live with their men and then maybe down the line, maybe five, ten years after okay, getting kids, they decide to get married. Yeah. So you find that not everyone has a ring because not everyone has done a church wedding. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So guys, that's it for what Nigerians think about Kenya or, or what perception Nigerians think about Kenyans and we'll be ending this vlog now hope you subscribe and please subscribe to Linda's channel I'll put in her handle down here so you guys can subscribe show her love I know we don't have much followers on my channel <laughs> she's way way bigger than I, I and I'm so grateful for her coming to share her love with me so Linda is there anything you want to say? So I'm Linda Mary guys, I'm from Kenya, I do a lot of lifestyle vlogs and also some sit down videos so you can subscribe to my channel and then we're also going to do a part 2 of this on my channel like what Kenyans think about Nigeria. Nigeria. So you can do <laughs> Yay! Thank you, I love you, bye! Bye bye! <laughs>